we're all blessed with genes from our parents. Thank you, mom and dad, you know, Thanks, right? Mom. But we have non-actionable and actionable genes. Non-actionable, I can't mm. change your eye color. Mm. Your propensity to have a unibrow, I'm sorry. If that's the case, <laughs> I can't do anything about it. But there are genes that are action, what we call actionable, mm -hmm. which means, yes, you can change the expression. And then there are nutritionally actionable genes, which means we know specifically, they're commonly found in the mass population. These aren't rare. We're not looking at rare genetic mutations. I'm looking at things that impact healthy lipids, body's ability to tox the bad cholesterol. Yes, yes, yes. Um, there are genes in that deal with the immune system that are actionable. Inflammation, gut health, methylation, everything, everything's the rage about methylation and everybody's talking about it, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, and it, it kind of turns on and off everything in layman's terms, right? Mm -hmm. Turns on and off everything, but you can't just address methylation. You mm -hmm. also have to address oxidative stress. And so you start putting all of these key genes together mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and we simplify it. We've done the science. I can take all of this information yeah. and custom compound for somebody into one supplement.